the government will provide a further $6 million in additional funding to the Doherty in partnership with the Burnett to do further work around rapid testing, uh, research around the most effective treatment for COVID-19, uh, as well as uh, the work that's already going on out there at the CSIRO in Clayton, manufacturing a vaccine. The Victorian Infectious Diseases Reference Laboratory is actually based here as well, and this is a collaboration together with the Royal Melbourne Hospital. And they have in fact been the statewide uh, lab for all the testing of uh, COVID-19. The work that is happening here is incredibly important. The funding that we are providing is going to enable uh, Vidral to also scale up its, uh, its testing. Uh, we expect that demand for testing will increase, of course, in coming weeks, so this will enable the lab to, to undertake more testing. The other aspect of the Victorian Government's investment in the COVID-19 response will go towards a consortium that will be led by us here at the Doherty together with the Burnett Institute, and together we'll develop a program of work targeted at developing novel diagnostics, a point of care test. And we're going to focus heavily on new therapeutics. At the moment, if you get COVID-19 and you're unwell, if you go to hospital, you'll get supportive care, meaning oxygen, treatment with antibiotics if you have another infection, maybe needing intensive care. But there's no specific drug at the moment for COVID-19. And we're going to use all the great minds across Victoria in, in testing existing drugs and also hopefully designing new drugs.